Hey guys, it's Jerry Shang here. I'm 17 years old and I'm from Beijing, China. Wait, are you 18? Shoot. <laughs> I see myself as a very good energy guy, always happy. His personality is somewhat infectious. He's a happy, smiley kid right now. He's always smiling, always happy to with everybody, always saying hello, very respectful. The same kid that you see like outside the court or talking to you is the same person like inside the court, which is rare. He's a gem. I mean, he's a total package. My dad, he was a professional footballer, and uh, my mom, who, who was the world champion in uh, mixed doubles and ping pong. So uh, the, these two combinations definitely gave me an advantage when I was a kid. I like to play around a lot and run around, be just happy about everything. So that's something I think my parents has put into me since I was a kid. When you do everything, you gotta do it 100%, but at the same time, you gotta have fun and enjoy the sport or the moment that you're having. The first time I saw Jerry, he was playing the 12 and under clay court nationals in the U.S. I remember thinking at the time, he seemed so advanced. He won in the finals against a kid 6'1", 6'2", and he already seemed almost like a man in some ways. His game was very mature already. What I saw was like, who's this kid? You see a kid who's 15 years old and he's playing like he's 25, so he was already very mature for his age. Very solid, amazing footwork, and very competitive kid. Jerry actually came from my parents when I was born, basically. That was uh, my nickname. Also, at the same time, it's fun with uh, everybody loves Tom and Jerry, the show. I also loved it when I was little. In tennis, you cannot be attacking or defensive the whole time. You do need to play the cat and mouse game on the court. We went to Australia, he did very good over there. He's a very smart guy, you know, and, uh, and he already knows a lot about tennis and about the sport. He likes to, to check uh, for himself, you know, a lot of the, the info. He's super humble. With all the things that he has achieved as a young player, he's always like eager to learn, to listen, and he, he's not the type of a guy who's gonna say like, no, no, I know more. Since the first time I met him at 12, he knows he belongs. There's no hesitation on, on his end when he comes to perform at the high level. So no surprise that he's here, and I have no doubt that he's gonna be at the very top of the game, and I think he's gonna be a superstar. I think ever since I started playing tennis, I want to be you know, one of the best players in the world, and uh, I think that's what every little kid, when they started one sport, they, that's what they think about. And for me, along the way, a lot of coaches, my parents, they've helped me a lot and to achieve this. And we're still working on it. And I think it's something that I don't put any pressure on. It's just tennis is my favorite hobby. Now it's my job. So I just try to make it you know, fun every day.